today we are going to discuss the IELTS academic book 9 test 4 task 2 the essay writing to what extent do you agree or disagree every year several languages die out some people think that this is not important because life will be easier if there are fewer languages in the world to what extent do you agree or disagree with this opinion this 40 minute 250 word essay can be written in four paragraphs in the introduction mention the topic and your opinion in para 1 discuss the convenience of having fewer languages in para 2 discuss why it is important to preserve redundant languages. And finally, summarize the essay. The following slides will show how this essay can be written. Do note the linking words in red and vocabulary in blue colored text. In the introduction, mention the topic and your opinion. As time goes by, a number of languages are becoming redundant as people are switching over to more popular ones. Most people are not concerned about this as they feel that by using popular languages, communication becomes more convenient. I partially agree with them as although I do acknowledge the convenience of using popular languages, I also feel that the dying out languages should be preserved. In this essay, I will discuss the reasons for my point of view on this subject. In para 1, discuss the convenience of having fewer languages. To begin with, it is true that using popular languages as official means of communication between administrative as well as financial organizations is more desirable because there would be no ambiguity in interpretation. This is particularly important owing to the nature of such communications. Moreover, where education is concerned, it is simpler to prepare teaching materials in popular languages as they are more versatile. In Para 2, discuss why it is important to preserve redundant languages. On the other hand, regional and unique languages have a lot of cultural value as they mark the identities of the people who spoke them. Old scriptures containing vital information related to social practices as well as possible cures to rare diseases could be found written in such languages. And therefore, these languages should be archived and saved for historic purposes, so that one can appreciate how people lived and communicated in the past. And finally, summarize the essay. In conclusion, I believe that one should switch over to languages that are widely known for better and easier communication. However, languages that were once spoken must be preserved because of their historical significance. The next slide will show the entire essay. You can pause to read at your own pace. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Do subscribe to my channel to receive regular updates on IELTS and other related topics. You can do so by clicking the subscribe button and the bell icon at the bottom right of this video. If you are interested in joining me for a one-on-one -on -one online session, then you can contact me by email or WhatsApp. My contact information can be found below this video in the description. Thank you for watching.